Hey guys, and welcome back to another Technology Guru video. So in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how you can link to a website. So you got a link to your website from within one of your YouTube videos. So you can only have one website or one URL, and it's gotta be your associated website with your YouTube channel. So in order to do that, navigate over to your Creator Studio by clicking the link in the upper right-hand corner and go to Creator Studio right here under your channel name. And then once you're there, click on the channel settings and then go to the bottom one that says advanced. Once you're there, you're going to see something here that says associated website. This means that once you get your website approved, once you go through the process of linking your website to your YouTube channel, you then will be able to link to it from a YouTube video. If you're a YouTube partner, which now requires you to have 4,000 hours of watch time and 1,000 subscribers. So if you need to know how to associate or link your website, I'll have a video that I did showing you how to do that up above as well as in the description of this video. Now, once you have associated your website, then what you're gonna wanna do is understand how you're going to do this. You're gonna do this utilizing YouTube cards. So if we go here, click on the card tab here in this video, you're going to see that I have this here that says, welcome to the YouTube Creators Hub. That's my website. If you click on that link, it's going to open up a new tab and take you directly to my website, which is exactly what we want to do. All right, so now that you've seen what we're doing, let's go ahead and I'm going to show you how to go about doing that. So. What we're going to want to do is go to our video manager and go and edit the video that we want to add the link to. And then once we're here, you're going to see the tab up here called cards. If we click on that there, uh, we're going to be navigated to our card section here for this specific video. Now, I recommend utilizing TubeBuddy, which is the tool that I use. If you want to check TubeBuddy out, it'll be in the description below. But uh, what you'll do is once you're here under the card section, you'll go to add card right here, and then you'll go all the way to the bottom that says link to an approved website. Go ahead and create that card there. Now, the link URL has to have the domain name or URL that is associated with your YouTube channel, hence the URL that we talked about earlier. So now I'm going to go ahead and type in www. you know, whatever my website name is here. Okay, I can't spell website.com. And then once you've done that, click the next button here. Or you can just click this here. It'll show you the exact site here in the drop down menu. And then you can link to a specific page on that site by typing it in here. Click next, and then once you've done that, it'll then create the card for you and al allow you to add an image, add a title for the card, as well as a call to action. I always choose visit my website or go to my site now or check this out or something very alluring, something that'll get them to click. A lot of time just to build my email list or something of that nature. Once you've done all of this, added your image, added your URL, click the create card button there, and then I'm not going to do it now, but as we've saw earlier, if we click on the cards here, it'll allow me to go and click on the link and directly from within the video on desktop or mobile, take them to my website. Now, if you have any questions Questions about doing any of the steps that I just took you through in the video, put those in the comment section below. I will get to that as quickly as possible. If you haven't already, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I would really appreciate it. Share this video with your friends and family, and I will see you guys next time.